，这样好。我是安瑞。<笑> Recently, some people have been suggesting some topics or videos that I can do, and thanks to this person right here, I decided that today I'm going to make some Swedish meatballs and mashed potatoes. So, first of all, I just have to let you know that even though I quite like cooking and、um, that I'm Swedish, so I should know this, but I'm actually not that good at making meatballs. Because in Sweden we have like pre-frozen meatballs and、uh, these kind of like powder mashed potatoes that you can just mix some water into and then you'll have it done. So I just usually go the laser route and buy that. So,、um... but I was thinking I'm gonna follow a recipe and I'm gonna like do my best to make like proper traditional Swedish meatballs. I'm gonna be linking the recipe down below. I don't think it'll be very useful because it's in Swedish. But I'll do it anyway, cause I'm a nice guy like that. <laughs> And、uh, I'm gonna try to make this video comprehensive, so you can actually learn how to make it yourself, so you can have a little piece of Sweden all to yourself at home in your kitchen. <laughs> And addition to the meatballs, I'm also gonna make some chocolate balls. Um, that's the literal translation of the Swedish like snack chokladbollar.、Uh, But I'm gonna make that as well. So we're gonna have two different kinds of tasty balls to snack on. That didn't come out right. Now that we're in the kitchen, let's start out by picking out the right ingredients. What we'll first need is around 250 grams of minced meat, some onion, half an onion in fact, egg. Bread crumbs, some good old mustard, and allspice. And with that, you should be set. Finish boiling. So in the meantime, I will make some chocolate balls. Cause that's really quick, and、uh, you need to put them in the cold for a while. So I'll do that. Okay. So in a bowl, mix together 100 grams of butter, one deciliter of sugar, three deciliters of oats, two spoons of cacao, one teaspoon of vanilla sugar, and also some cold coffee. I don't know how much. Just. A little bit, not too much, not a little. Like we Swedes like to say, log on. And now, just the same as when we made those meatballs, let's wash our hands first and mix that shit. Hi, <laughs> this is totally same day me. Here to tell you that、uh, you will also need to make some onion sauce, and to make that you will need to cut two onions and fry them for a while, and then、um, add some red wine vinegar, some broth, mustard, and also some. Whipping cream. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Just fry that for a while until it's warm, and then put it on the side. That's that's all. Someone's calling me. Bye bye. <laughs>
time to eat. I'll have you know, because I was recording all this, this took like three times longer than it would usually take. Anyway, let's see. How does this actually taste like? Mm. Quite flavorful, actually. Mm. This onion sauce is way too much. The, the meatballs don't look good, but they taste okay. And, um, and the, yeah, the mashed potatoes is okay. It's fine. Normal mashed potatoes. It's passable, considering I basically never made it. And let's see about chocolate balls. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yeah, that's good. Mm. Well, I made these a lot of times, so. <laughs> of course, these will be tasty. Oh. Oh, I love this. Mmm. Oh, that's good. I'd rather just eat this. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Actually, I think this is... Mmm. Quite a success. It's actually good. Which, compared to my Shion Shui Chao Jidan, is really good. Actually, it would be really fun if you... If you decide to make this, and... Um, then if you could send me a video or a picture. Uh, so I could see how you did, and you could tell me like how you felt and this kind of things. Then that would be real fun. Thanks so much, and um, take care of yourself. I'll see you next time. Oh, bye.